bad boys as promised um, I'm going to do a little video on the swap and drop method which we use when we're writing chemical formula so when I say chemical formula it's something that looks like this so the name of this one is aluminium oxide okay I'm going to do a practice one with you to make um, I'm going to make magnesium nitride all right so in the test or practice example or whatever you're doing you should have access to a table which tells you what the a list of cations i've obviously only got two here a list of cations or positive ions and a list of anions or negative ions okay so we look at the formula that we need to make the first one is always going to be the cation so magnesium here it is so we write that down with that step one magnesium which has a two plus charge and then our anion nitride which is down here and then we have nitro which has a three negative charge now before we do the swap and drop method we need to check whether we actually need to do it at all so if the two ions have they're always going to have opposite charges one's going to be positive one's going to be negative if they're the same number the numbers just cancel each other out and you would write that straight underneath so let's just say it's not but let's just say this was two minus they would cancel each other out and your answer would be just like that you would have no numbers no numbers down here no charges up the top that would be the answer and you don't need to do the swap and drop but because they are different we have two plus on the magnesium and three minus on the nitride we do need to do the swap and drop so the next step <clears throat> is to rewrite these letters down here so we have magnesium is going to be the first one just like aluminium because that's a cation because it's a metal so we know it's going to form a cation and then the nitride and so when we say swap we swap the charges so the two unattaches from the magnesium and comes down here and the three unattaches from the nitride and comes down here so it becomes magnesium with the three and nitride with a2 so that's the swap and the reason we say drop swap and drop there's actually two reasons one is because we physically drop the number from above the letters to the bottom of the letters and then we also drop or get rid of these charge symbols here so the final answer should look like this like that if your final answer for a chemical formula has any pluses or minuses in it that is always wrong okay we never write a chemical formula with a charge attached to it that's only for when we're writing ions by themselves okay hope that helps guys let me know if you have any other questions